Hi, my name's Stuart Sheldon. I'm the lead rigger for HMS Victory here at the National Museum of the Royal Navy in Portsmouth. The National Museum is a collection of different museums around the UK. We have sites in Belfast, Hartlepool, Yeovilton, Gosport and Portsmouth. Together they tell the history of different branches of the Royal Navy and how they link to today's modern Navy. The National Museum of the Royal Navy is the custodian of HMS Victory on behalf of the Royal Navy. She's still a commissioned warship, the oldest one in the world, and the only surviving example of a ship of the line from the Great Age of Sail. As the custodians of her, we are responsible for ensuring that she can still fulfil her role as the first Sea Lord's flagship, but also as a museum attraction for members of the public to come and visit here in Portsmouth. As part of this, we are undertaking a 10-year conservation project to ensure that she is able to fulfil both these roles for the next 50 years. When the museum became the Custodians of Victory, we inherited a large storage footprint here in Portsmouth at the old rope wharf. This had previously been used for mass storage, so it had already got some cantilever racking and some pallet racking. The majority of items were stored on ground level. In order to undertake the works required for the 10-year conservation projects of Victory and also to store the materials of timber, rope um, and also a lot of the historical artefacts that are coming off Victory as part of the conservation work. We needed to rationalise that storage space to make best use of the um, available footprint that we had. The National Museum is a publicly funded body so we are bound by public procurement rules which means that we undertook a tender process to ensure that we went through a fair selection process when selecting our chosen contractor for this. Total Interiors came out as our preferred option as they impressed us during the tender process with their professional approach and attitude towards the work that we were undertaking. Almost before we'd completed the install of the racking, it enabled us to start moving items around in the spaces to free up floor space. So we've both relocated timber stucks within the spaces to make them more available for the shipwrights who are um, starting to build parts of Victory. The benefits from consulting directly with um, the people who specialise in designing and installing it mean that you can dip into that knowledge and get a end result which is bespoke to you and is guaranteed to provide you with the solution that you need. Total Interiors were a really professional and friendly organisation to deal with. From the initial discussions with the sales directors right down through the project management team and the installers, you really got a sense that you were their sole focus and that working around your business still maintaining its productivity and the install not impacting on that was their main focus. We were particularly impressed with their install team who managed to work around our operations ongoing and delivered the install ahead of time. I think that the combination of a family-led business combined with the selection of industry professionals that they've drawn together in their team means that you really can get everything you need from one supplier. Anyone wanting to come and see the Once in a Generation Conservation Works on HMS Victory or visit any of our other sites around the UK can find details at nmrn.org.uk.